the Storm Games. This is another Hearthstone Tavern Brawl. This week we actually have a repeat of a Tavern Brawl, and um, so today we, I've got Misty with me. She's been kind of dabbling into a little bit of, ta of uh, Hearthstone lately. Mm -hmm. So she hasn't got her got to a spot in her game where she can actually play the Tavern Brawls. So she's going to play mine today um, with, with us here. And what do we got today, Misty? Uh, it says spiders, spiders everywhere. Um, so it says spiders have overrid, overrun everything, including your deck. Whatever class, whatever class you play, your deck will be teeming with web spinners. And show us what we're going to win today. We get to win a pack for the very first victory this week. So it's the same, same, same as all, it's always been. They haven't changed that prize up. So let's go ahead and put. That was in your mind. She's controlling everything today. First time. So looks like this time you get to pick your class and they give you a deck. So you get to pick whatever class you want to do. I've been, Doesn't matter. I've been doing now, good Now, the way these me. usually work is when you get to pick your class and they give you a deck, they will usually give... Uh, I've played this this web spinner one myself when it first came, when they first did Tavern Brawl. I think it was the very first one, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and what this does, it just basically fills your deck with web spinners, um, which are a 1-1 one -one minion that when it dies, it summons a random beast. I think it's a random two or three, le or three or less mana cost beast. Not sure about that. It may be just any random beast. Um, but that's what that's what happens. And you also get if you the reason it gives you a chance to choose your hero, your class, is because the other cards that might be in the deck will be for that class. So if you choose a druid, you might get some druid spells mixed in. There. If you choose a priest, you might get some priest spells mixed in. There. So druids, which you want to play, go ahead and brawl. And you might choose a partner. Okay. This part always takes, seems like it takes forever. Sometimes. We were playing where they're late at night, so I'm going to take a look at this second so we can have time to decide. It's a week night. <laughs> and I don't believe, and you guys can correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't believe uh, the tavern brawls match you up to the level like the uh, regular matches do. Malfurion versus Uther. Because everything is so rare. I will fight with honor. See, I must protect the uh, wild. So. Good hit, uh, good tip I want to give everybody out there, Ian Misty, here is when you're given your first hand like this, go ahead and get rid of it all because you're going to get a lot of these web spinner cards. Um, and the idea is you want to try to get some of your class spells in there. See, so you got to. A, uh, web, a wild growth, which which will be helpful at turn two to get that extra mana and get that mana curve. Um, but the only minions you're going to get in your deck are these web spinners. Hmm. But when they die, it summons any ran it can summon any random beast card, up to um, the T Rex, which his name's Crush or something like that. He's a nine nine minion with charge. He's a Big, so uh, I big start with one of these. Yep, turn one. Might as well get him out there. Get as many of them out there as you can. Anyway. Job's done. That's it. Because the faster, yep, the faster they kill those minions, or you're able to attack with them and get them killed, the, the faster you're going to get better minions on the deck, on the hand, on the uh, board. So you can turn I do the wild growth. Uh, uh, well. Yeah, I would. I mean, because it's not really going to make too much of a difference. On his turn two, he might play a Paladin card, yeah. or he might just play two Web Spinners. But see, that gives you on the turn three. Go ahead and attack uh -huh. his Web Spinner. Going to kill him both. And looks like you got a Core Rager. 
is not a bad card for a 4-4. Uh, if, what's it say, if it's, if your hand is empty, you gain 3-3. Three, three. Might not be a bad card to hang on, hang on to. Yeah. Uh, so go ahead and play your wild growth because there's what no to do? no cards out there. Right now, so. Hopefully we didn't get done. something that costs three mana. And, uh, some a three mana card or beast that he can play. Right. Well, it's actually two mana. He's on two, yeah. so. We could play a two mana piece that we just gave him, or we can play two web spinners. Probably play two. So maybe a web spinner and a secret. Alright, so I would go ahead and put all four webs up. Or maybe three webs and an arrow power. Or two webs and an arrow power. Um, just go ahead and make the board with web spinners. Ah! Ah! Board presence, he's ah! Job's done. And you've got the man. So you don't have these on the on the mobile. We do. Really? Yeah. You can do all that. Ah! It's just uh, some a uh, certain mobile. Certain phones, if your phone isn't big enough, you can't, uh, you can't actually show. Oh, you can actually pull his horn on this side. There you go. Nope. Oh, the tip of his horn. Reporting for duty. Alright, so what's he giving you here? Level 5, destroyer, and a mini mini, or two or less. Okay, so. Scavenging Hyena. Oh, <laughs> um, Stampeding Kodo. Um. Not sure. What's the what other one? To do? The Hyena, what's oh. the Hyena thing? Um, oh, okay. Oh. Never friendly beast dies, gain 2 1. Ooh, that's a good one to put out. And. Do go ahead and drop spinner. him and then a hero power. That might be a good play. With your. things there, kill. Time waits for no one. Silver hand recruit. For the wild. Well done. We've got beasts in our hand. Uh, this one we don't want Yeah. The trick with this whole thing is, is to fill your fill your hand with beasts, but try not to fill theirs in the process. Ooh, what is? Does that do anything? Uh, it's a decent four. Uh, five fours aren't too bad. Really big. Um, play your owl. Silence the monkey. Yep. Silence the monkey. Done. Or what's this? Oh, it's inspired. Okay, that's fine. Um, yep, we'll end that. Now we've got board presence. So board if, he, at this point. If, he use, if he kills one of these, yeah, he needs to kill that hyena, or it's just gonna get stronger every time a minion, but a beast dies. That includes his beast. <laughs> First of all, we need to use your hero power. Isn't that cool? That's our first inspire, by the way. Okay. Um, 
Let's go ahead and... No, we're going to leave that web spinner alone because we don't want to give him another okay. minute. We're going to go get your tall strider out. What? To For the wild. Nature strikes. We got the upper hand early by having that mana curve, it really helped. So if you're looking for your win, maybe a druid might not be a bad idea. Pray for that <laughs> interval to give you that mana curve there. To Well played. Do one one to all your minions. The victory is yours. <laughs> he wasn't gonna wait for me. Traditionally, yeah! that's when we have to pack the cards, we open them up on the video here. So, go ahead and open the packs. I know how to do this. Okay. That guys, that, that was the gist of uh, the tavern brawl. Go ahead and open it back up. Um, this is one that I've seen pop up three times now, I think. So every so often, I do slip this one back in. I believe it was their original tavern brawl, the very first one. So uh, there you go. There's not much to it. You get a bunch of web spinners and some class spells if you're lucky, and then you got to you got to play with what the hand you dealt. So, thanks for watching, guys. See you later. Uh, bye bye.